Hey everyone, I'm going to walk you through the e-commerce functionality available to you in Lifter LMS. So to start out, I'm going to I'm in the settings here and I'm going to navigate to gateways and Lifter LMS comes ready to use PayPal right out of the box. So you'd click uh, if you want to use PayPal, you'd click enable PayPal, you'd put in all your credentials here and you'd be off to the races. We also have a premium extension for Infusionsoft that would allow you to use the Infusionsoft payment gateway if that's something that you wanted to do. So after you have your gateway set up, you would go over here to checkout and you tell us which page you want your checkout page to be and which page you want your confirmation page to be. The other thing is that you could also use WooCommerce simply by going to integrations and enabling WooCommerce if that's something that you wanted to use to, for your e-commerce uh, part of your LMS. Now. We also have the ability to look at orders. If you navigate down to orders, you can look up someone's order and see how they purchased and so forth. Also, coupons. You can set up coupons. One of the things I really like about coupons is that you can select the, the name of the coupon itself, testing123 if I wanted it to be that. The discount type, if it's a percentage or dollar amount, so maybe I want to do $100 off. The usage limit, how many times it can be used. And if you're using our Infusionsoft Premium add-on, you could actually tell us which tag to apply when a certain coupon was used. Now, if I navigate up to the course section, uh, that's where the magic happens, as they say. And you scroll right below here, and you could set up the SKU for the course, the price, and if it's on sale, you could select the on sale box here, put the sale price and put the sale date so you can actually kind of automate your promos allowing a sale to only happen for seven days or something like that. Uh, and then we have some pretty dynamic reoccurring payment options also. So if you select reoccurring payments, you could just do a like $50 a month program. So you put $50 in there, you'd select month and you'd put a zero in the billing cycles so you'd be billed in indefinitely or you'd bill your customers indefinitely until they canceled. You could also put a 12 month program or so forth. We also have day, week, year, so giving you some flexibility with your reoccurring payment options. We also have this we also have this initial payment option allowing you to do like free trials. So you could do a $1 trial that then went into a $50 a month program and so forth. You can also select the frequency of payments here if you'd like to bill on a bi-monthly basis or so forth. So that's an overview of the e-commerce functionality available to you in Lifter LMS. I hope you've enjoyed this walkthrough.